Hello, senior high school students and teachers. So, our lesson today is to find the derivative of each function using the quotient rule. So, y is equal to x plus 1 times x squared plus 6x over x minus 1. First, we need to identify the value of u. So, ang u natin, of course, the numerator. Okay, so x plus 1 times x squared plus 6x. Okay, para mas madali sa atin ang pagkuha ng derivative nito, uh, we need to multiply first this one. So, x times x squared, that is x cubed. Okay, so x times 6x, that is positive 6x squared. Okay, 1 times x squared, that is positive x squared. 1 times 6x, that is positive 6x. So, if we're going to combine this, so the answer is x cubed plus 7x squared plus 6x. Okay, so that will be the answer, right? So x squared, uh, x cubed plus 7x squared plus 6x. And then, yung v natin, of course, yung denominator, x minus 1. So after nito, kunin natin yung derivative ng u. So ang derivative ng u, so what is the derivative ng x cubed? That is 3x squared. Derivative ng 7x squared, that is 2 times 7, that is 14x. Derivative ng 6x is positive 6. So, kasi kakailanganin din natin to. And then, yung derivative ng v, derivative ng x is 1. Okay, kasi yung negative 1, 0 na. Then, applying the formula of quotient rule, so y prime is equal to v, okay, v times du, minus u times dv, okay, over v squared. So, substitute lang natin yung mga nakuha natin dito. So, ang v natin is x minus 1 times ang du natin is 3x squared plus 14x plus 6 minus, okay, so, ito ay part 3 na no, ng video natin about quotient rule. So, may nauna ng dalawang video lesson. So, pwede nyo balikan yun pa, uh, for more exercises. And then, what is u? That is x plus 1 times x squared plus 6x times yung dv natin is 1. Okay. So, we need to multiply that. All over, yung v squared natin is x minus 1 squared. So, after this, okay, kailangan muna natin. So, multiply muna natin dito sa side para hindi tayo mahirapan. No? Or, para lang medyo maiksi yung solution nyo. So, x minus 1, 3x squared plus 14x plus 6. So, multiply muna natin dito sa side. So, this is x times 3x squared, that is 3x cubed. x times 14x is positive 14x. x, uh, x squared rather. x times 6, that is positive 6x. Negative 1 times 3x squared, that is negative 3x squared. Negative 1 times 14x, negative 14x. Negative 1 times 6, that is negative 6. So, combine similar terms, so 3x cubed. 14x squared minus 3x squared is positive 11x squared. 6x minus 14x is negative 8x minus 6. So that is negative 8x minus 6. So this will be the answer. I hope. Uh, kindly check also our answer. So 3x squared. Alright, so that 3x cubed rather plus 11x squared. Minus 8x minus 6. So, lagay natin dito. So, that will be our answer. 3x cubed. 3x cubed. Plus 11x squared. Minus 8x minus 6. Minus. Okay, ito plus x plus 1 times x squared plus 6x times 1. So, kapag minultiply natin yung dalawa, ito yun. No? Yung kanina yung kinuha natin, yung u natin. So, ang sagot natin doon ay x cubed kasi pag minultiply natin itong lahat sa 1, yun pa din ang sagot. Ang answer natin is x cubed 
plus 7x squared plus 6x. Okay, that will be the answer. All over x minus 1 squared. And after that, so ilabas natin yung nasa loob ng parenthesis. So we have 3x cubed plus 11x squared minus 8x minus 6 minus x cubed minus 7x squared minus 6x over x minus 1 squared. So, 3x cubed minus x cubed, that is 2x cubed. 11x squared minus 7x squared, that is positive 4x squared. Negative 8x minus 6x, that is negative 14x. And then, copy negative 6 over x minus 1 squared. So, this is now the derivative of the given function. So, y prime is equal to 2x cubed plus 4x squared minus 14x minus 6 all over x minus 1.